So here's the problem. Here's what's interesting about it. So the most girls at any one point, I had, I had four premises and I had 75 girls on the books. They weren't all working at once, but I had 75 girls who would do like one shift a week or three days a week or seven days a week. 75 women worked for me at the peak of it all. But that was a mistake because when you have a bunch of girls working for you like that, the only way you can motivate them is with money. And it's better if, when I started, the girls worked for me because they loved me, right? That's the old school pimp game, isn't it? I love this man. We're on our way to the top together. We're going to go Maldives. We're making all this money. You know, it's the old school dream. But when you get too big, you can't have all these girls in love with you. I mean, you can only fuck so much. Like, we're all human, right? So you, you can't deal with that many women. So then you have to motivate them with money. And if you're trying to motivate a woman with money, it's impossible because, and any feminist will disagree with me, but I'll tell you something. Women are loyal to one thing on the planet. And the only thing they're loyal to is, is the man they want to have sex with. That is it. If a woman's working for you and she's making 10 grand a week, but her man who, who's banging her is like, I don't want you at that. Who's the fuck is this guy pimping you out? You're there with this dude. He thinks he's something that I know. Fuck him, quit. They're going to quit. Or he'll say, we can do it together, even though they can't because there's a whole bunch of, people think it's easy, right? It's not easy. You need equipment. You need, sorry, the tax, the banking. You need to know how to handle the guys. It's not easy to do. So every time there was a girl who I wasn't sleeping with, she never lasted long. So... Then I had these four big premises, all these overheads, all these managers that got out of control. So I cut down to like a special forces team of around eight girls. And that's where I made my most money. When I had four girlfriends, my brother had four girlfriends, me, my brother, eight women living in one house and all the women adored us and they obeyed us. And at the peak, I was turning over 400 grand a month. With eight girls? With eight girls, yeah. He's all sleeping with the same girls? No, so he had his four, I had my four. We so don't, we don't mix, we don't mix.